Hello, everyone. Um, this is the another uh, art subscription box. This is Creative Art Box. Well, this is this is sort of like a crafting type of art box too, you know, because sometimes it's got art supplies, sometimes it's got you know uh, craft supplies, and sometimes it's got mixed media. I don't know what's in this box, but um, we are about to find out. Now, uh, I was not able to get to the uh, February's Creative Art Box. Um, this is also a, a super awesome box. Um, I was not able to get to uh, February's because of my eye. Um, I've already explained everything in a previous vid video, so I will not get into it again. You can always go to the last video I did, and you can find out why I have problems with my eye. Um, so anyway, let us get into this box, and it is kind of a small box. It's not really, really heavy. It's, there's got a little bit of weight to it, but not too heavy. And I did break the seal, and it's got a piece of paper in it that I, actually I recycle this stuff. Because, you know, you can always use this stuff for mixed media stuff, you know? I mean, you can always take this, do a little painting on it or something, you know, sprinkle it up, use it for, you know, dabbing on painting. So, anyway, that is... And then we have, also inside, oh, we've got a flow. This would be good for a doll. You know what I mean? Like a jean doll or, you know, just put a little a piece of cloth on it. You got a pillow. Anyway, <laughs> that's not what I use these for. I use these for packing material. And let me see. Let me get the card out that's in here. There is a card in here. I see it there on the top. There it is. There it is. There it is. Okay, put that back in the box. All right. Now, let's see here. Get that back there so it doesn't keep flopping in the front. Okay, it says here, this is a super awesome box, like I said. And the first one in the... Oh, okay. It's one Ken Oliver. I'm having trouble reading here. I'm only working on one eye, guys. Um, it's one Ken Oliver Color Burst Powder, and it's 583. Let me see. Oh, I guess this is it. This is it. Oh, I've never seen this stuff before. I don't, I've never worked with this stuff. And this color is Orchid. I love purple. That's my favorite color. I love purple colors. Let me see. It's concentrated watercolor powder. I've never heard of concentrated watercolor uh, powder. With fine tip applicator. Oh. Okay, let me see here. Oh, okay. There it is. Oh, how cool is that? Well, let me see here. Let me see. Get a... a uh, page here where I can do some swatches. That's my foreign voice. <laughs> that I'm not very good at. <laughs> Okay, I guess I'm going to need a water brush or something. Let me see if I can find a water brush. i am always got a water brush handy somewhere. That one's got a little bit of water in it. Let me see here. Oops, I knocked you. Let's see here. Okay, let's put the powder down. Ooh, that's powder? Whoops, that looks like... Oh, it is powder. Oh my gosh, it is powder. Okay, let me see here. Is my brush wet? Yes. Ooh, that's really pretty. Look at that. That is, that is deep. That is a really deep purple. I guess if I keep working it, it'll get lighter. But that is deep purple. Look at that. Wow. I know I'm impressed. Goodness gracious, that's a deep color. All right, that's that. I'll have to clean off my brush later. I will clean off my brush later. Okay, and let me see what else is in the box. Is a one Kuretake Genzai Tambi Starry Color Watercolor Palette. What? Watercolor palette? Hold on a second. Oh, okay, I got it, I got it. This. 
Ooh, I know what this is. I've got a whole, I got a whole uh, thing full of these watercolors, and I have not used them yet. <laughs> but I can't see. I can't see really good right now. <laughs> so I haven't really tried them. Dog on it. I haven't really tried these yet. And my color is. I don't know if anybody else gets different colors in these, but my color is the white, the white kind of diamond type of, I don't know what color you would call this, but it's not gold. <laughs> it's a silvery color, I guess. Let me see. i got to clean off my brush here. Let's see here. i got to clean off my brush so I don't contaminate it with this purple. Okay, hold on a minute. No, it doesn't want to. Clean off. I, I've got, I may have to get out another water brush that's cleaner. Ah, this one's cleaner. Yes, it's my. This is my go-to water brush. I do. I love this brush. This this water brush and this water brush are my two favorite water brushes. I'm. They're my go-to water brushes. This one's almost empty, so I'm. I have to. Put, I have to put the little baby bad boy away. Okay. Oh, I better. I better seal this little bad boy up, otherwise I want to get all that stuff all over the place. We don't want that. We do not want it all over. Okay. And do 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 do. Okay. Am I getting any of it? Oh my! I don't think I'm getting any of it. Hold on a minute. Oh, okay, I am. This is such a pretty color. I like it reminds me of moonlight. I don't know if you can. This is really. Oh, yeah, there it is. Can you see that? It's, yeah, you can see it, I guess. I guess you can see it. Yeah, you can see it. It's right there. That is really. You keep doing it, and it, gets, it just gets, seems to get darker and darker and darker and darker. Nice. Nice. Pretty. Where's my. Just had a. Oh well, won't worry about it. I'll put this back in this little little plastic bag. These things are expensive, though. What did I say the price was? Three dollars and thirty thirty three cents, and that's just for this. Can you imagine what a whole mess of these things are going to cost? You know, like, say, a whole pallet full? That's expensive. I, but if I would think it would be worth it, though, because just going by that... I can't get this back in its plastic sleeve. Doggone it. I am not doing good today. I did a video just a few minutes ago when I was having problems with one of the, the, uh, the items. So this is another video you know, falling right after each other. Because I'm trying to get all these for March out in March and not in April. Okay, and then we've got three Caran d'Ache watercolor brush markers and they're six seventy five. I do not know. I presume that is each. And here's the three brushes. And we have got, looks like a yellow color, a black, and a, a, um, a green. So let us do some splotches. I have one more of these brushes that came in a in a um, earlier uh, a subscription box, but I don't remember. I think it might have been in a mystery box, a creative art mystery box. I think I'm not positive. Don't quote me on that. But I have one more of these. Too bad I can't use that one too. <laughs> Yeah, I would say, I guess you could say it's a gold, it could go for gold, but I would say it's a yellow ochre. And this one here would be a kind of a lime green. I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with these colors. Now, I don't know if everybody got the same colors in their box, but these are the colors I got. Or I should, that was bad grammar, I received. Oh, and here's the uh, brush tip. This is what the brush tip looks like what I received, not what I got. That's bad grammar. I was raised better than that. Okay, let me see here. Um, 
And then we have one sponge, which is 99 cents, a sponge. I would presume this is the sponge right there. That is a sponge. And I presume that is to be used in something that has to do with whatever's in this box. Well, you saw the sponge. This is the sponge. This is the little itty bitty sponge. I save all these things. I mean, you wouldn't think to save something like that, but I'd save it. And then we have uh, do, 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 a one mini spray bottle. And there is the spray bottle right there. It is a little, this thing is really hard to use because they gave us a spray bottle in another creative art box. And it was for, the, I think it was December's, November, December's, it was with the tiles. And they got, they had a little spray bottle that went, went, went with it. I think you put alcohol in it or something. Yeah, you put alcohol in it. I don't know. I, it, it was very difficult to use it. it. I mean, it really was. It's, it's so tiny. But anyway. And then we have uh, one H2O water brush. Oh, goody. Another water brush. I like water brushes. And that's. The water brush, I like that. I like that. I, I love having water brushes. I am totally in love with them. And if it had not been for art subscription boxes, I would have never, ever known these little bad boys existed. I'm serious. I've always used a regular old, you know, a watercolor brush. So, and, and that's how out of touch with, you know, the art world that I was. So, that's one thing I'm grateful for, these, these, uh, these, um, these boxes, and I also have to say that I am not paid, you know, uh, I'm not paid. Um, creative Art Box did not send this to me. This was given to me as a gift, so um, and my husband got it for me, and um, so I am not, you know, sponsored by Creative Art Box, but if they ever want to sponsor me, I'll, I'll do it for them. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I just enjoy their boxes. Oh, uh, let me see here. Oh, uh, let me see. Two unique reusable stencils. Stencil, stencil, stencils. Here we are. Oh, I've got sort of polka dots, and I'm not sure what kind of this kind of like reminds me like maybe of the middle of Middle East, you know, the Middle Eastern grills and stuff like you'd see in the harems, you know, like you know that that wall that you know the the girls can look out, you know, to see what's going on and and you know that kind of thing, or or the sultan could look out and see what the girls are doing in the harem and stuff. That's what this reminds me of that this this pattern right here. So that's pretty cool. Maybe I should do something like maybe somebody behind it, you know, peering out. I don't know. And then of course we've got dots. So these are pretty cool. I always can use more stencils. Okay, and oh, the stencils are, um, let me see, oh, and let me see, the water brush retails for $2.99, the mini spray bottle for $0.99. Cents. I'm sorry, guys, the spray bottle is not worth $0.99. Cents. If it was a little bit bigger, maybe, but not that tiny little thing. I'm sorry, not worth it. Um, let me see, the reusable stencils are $1.98. Um, I don't know if I said um, the water brush was $2.99. Okay, and then four Stradmore 140-pound coal press paper. Two white and two black. Okay, here's one. This one white. Second white. These are pretty stiff. They are stiff. And we've got two black. Here we are. We've got two black ones. That that white that white will show up really well. Now I would put I would you know do a swatch on there, but I don't like to use them until you know I don't like to do anything until I'm ready to use it. Okay, and these papers are do 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 a dollar forty nine I presume each. And then we've got ooh here's a super item six gold copper silver flake sheets. Ooh, $4.29 for, for these bad boys. Oh, i got to be real careful here. Hold on a minute. I have got to be really careful. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, some of it's already started to flake. Oh, my gosh. This is so freaking cool. You know what? I'm just going to have let, let you look into the box. Can you, can you see the, bo the flakes? Because, oh, I mean the flakes because they are starting to flake already. And I don't want it to do any more flaking until I'm ready to use them. So, and then here's another one. 
So I, I really have to be real, real careful with these. Oh my God. See, can, can you see that some of it's like on the, oops, on the, like, I don't know if you can see that, but like on the little corner here, it started to flake off already. So it's just, you know, being jostled around in the box. See right over here on this one too. So I have to be really, really careful. So anyway, hoo -hoo. Um, let me see. We've got another super item. Uh, it's, um, let me see. Hold on. My eye's not focusing. Um, it's three stencil gears. And that was in this little thing right here. So these are the little stencil gears in here. I don't want to open this thing up right now. There's one, there's two, and then there's three. There's another one right there. So there's, there's little, you know, that would be kind of like steampunk. Do something Victorian-ish. Um, let me see here. And then we have one glue stick. And here's the glue stick. And, of course, it looks just like a glue stick. Let's see. What's it? Uh, it's a baton de... Well, it doesn't say what name brand it is. Let me see here. Oh, it's a Jot. That's the name brand, Jot. Never heard of it. Okay. That's the glue stick. And then we have super another super item. Oh, the glue stick is 99 cents. The... Three stencil gears are 90 or 79 cents. And the other super item is one craft brush. And here's the craft brush. I am not very fond of these things. You can tell right now. It's it's I haven't even used it and it's already kind of warped. So I guess what I'll have to try to do is use it on those uh, those little sheets. Because I mean they're oh those are so pretty. Look how pretty these are. I love it, they shine, I love it. I've never done anything like that before. Yay! I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I gotta do something. <laughs> My eyesight's just gotta come back again. Um, it says here, um, there are several ways that you can use your color brush powder. Mix color, um, burst, uh, power, power? I think it was supposed to be <laughs> say powder, but it ha they have it spelled power. <laughs> With water in a palette or paint directly on watercolor paper. Spray water bottle, water, spray watercolor paper with water, then sprinkle uh, with color burst and watch the colors explode. Or you can sprinkle uh, with color burst first and then spray with water. You can create a modeled uh, background by uh, letting the spritz method dry and then putting water uh, drops on top and blotting off with a paper towel. You can stencil with the color burst. Simply lay your stencil on watercolor paper, sprinkle a bit of color burst, and then mist w with water. You can also use the brush pow power. I guess, well, is that what it's called? Brush power? No, that's not what it's called. It's not called brush power. But they keep saying brush power instead of brush powder. It's throwing me off, man. You're throwing me off my groove here. <laughs> Um, you can uh, let's see. You can also uh, use the brush uh, burst power with stamps and embossing. The sponge is a great way to stencil in the lines. You can use a small piece of tape to keep the stencil in place. You your gan ganzai pan is ideal for calligraphy, stenciling, illustrations, brush lettering, and more. Use your water brush and wet the pan with water to activate it. You can. Listen, oh, you pan may appear, oh, it's supposed to be your pan, but the way they've got it is you pan it may appear cracked, but it will not affect its quality. These people need a proofreader before they print these things up, because otherwise they throw off the sentence completely when they don't have it written right. That drives me absolutely bonkers. Anyway, <laughs> it's okay if I mess up. But not okay if the sentence is messed up to begin with, because then I'm like, did I read that right? Am I got that right? And then I have to read it again, and then, nope, I got it right. They have it wrong. <laughs> anyway, drives me crazy. Um, your Caran d'Ache is a fib uh, fiber-tipped brush pen with water-soluble ink. The sturdy tip um, offers a multitude of artistic possibilities. With vibrant colors, these pins are ideal for coloring, drawing, calligraphy, comics, and lively sketches. Okay, here we go. Hey, you! <laughs> I'm reading it the way they've got it. 
Um, you are super awesome. So you have also received three gears <laughs> that you were missing from your brain. So now you can put them back in. Anyway, <laughs> um, they can be used to <laughs> in mixed media art as stencils. You have also received six gold, copper, silver uh, flake sheets. Gold leaf is, is gold that's been hammered into a thin foil. That's actual real gold. Um, well, gold leaf. That's what I'm saying. Anyway, um, do, 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 um, it, it's often used to decorate picture frames, books, plates, mixed media, and even food. The best way to use gold leaf is to brush or roll on an adhesive such as glue. Then you can brush on the gold that uh, but, uh, leaf using your craft brush. Remove the excess gold and voila! You can also um, seal it afterwards if desired with Mod Podge. Gold leaf is tricky to work with because it can get sticky and flaky. Um, take your time, plant ahead, and you can create a beautiful masterpiece. And that is the Creative Art Box for March. Now, I will try my best to do something with these lovely, 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 lovely materials. Um, but like I have said before, it's my eye that's my problem. And it, it does really make it difficult to uh, do anything with one eye. I mean, I have to get used to just working with one eye. Let's put it that way. Um, I know there are people out there who are have only one eye so and they do perfectly well you know without two eyes so I've just got to get used to I mean I've had two eyes all my life so um and I'm used to two eyes so <laughs> please forgive me um that I'm not quite prepared to try anything with using one eye I'm still struggling even reading with just the one eye but um God willing, like I said, my right eye will improve and I will be back to having two eyes again. But anyway, that is the March Creative Art Box. And I hope wherever you are in the world, you are having a wonderful day. And if you are interested in the Creative Art Box, I will leave a link b uh, below. And if you aren't, you know, you don't want this particular box, they do offer a mystery box and they do offer just a regular box. You do not have to get the super awesome box. Um, but my husband always, because I'm a super awesome person, my, my, my husband always gets me the super awesome box. So, um, but anyway, they also offer a mystery box and a super mis a mystery box and a super awesome mystery box. So, um, the link is below so that if you want to, you know, check out creative art box and see what you get. Um, you can. I would recommend it because these things are so much fun. Anyway, you, um, wherever you are in the world, I hope you are having a wonderful day. And you all take care of yourselves. Be good to each other. Till next time, God bless. Bye.